there we got some <gasps> f1 2013 whoa whoa exciting stuff on that last time we finished a season challenge so you don't see it listed there in career anymore from what i've read the multiplayer co-op championship actually isn't dead like this stuff actually isn't dead this stuff still works no nope, no one plays though this stuff still works this stuff didn't shut down there was supposed to be a server shut down on the 21st but it didn't happen for uh the races the uh race that thing shut down so you can't make an account with RaceNet anymore. And the only achievement that got discontinued as of right now is uh, that one for making a car and then d racing it on a classic track or whatever. Uh, which one was that? I'm trial maybe. Is this thing I think? This car? Or is that car? I'm pretty sure it was this one. Could be wrong. If you didn't make an account and get this car from RaceNet before uh, the server shut down, then you can't get that achievement. I did the achievement months ago, though, so... Because I saw it was online only, I'm like, well, I was doing this one. I did that one back in, like, December, I'm pretty sure. I'm all covered there. Better get them backup saves. Oh no! Oh no! Well, we finished the uh, season challenge, so now today we're going to work on getting those those shiny golds. You see those bottom two there? No golds for those yet. And we're going to work on getting the shiny golds for here, and here, and here. We're going to suffer. Let's see how many gold medals we can get today. Ensure that you finish within the points. And do gold clash. Reco Looks like next up is Monza. Ensure that you finish within the points. I'm at 14th and I have to get in the points, which means 10th at least. You get one point if you get to 10th. Wow. Let's go practice. A lot of shiny gold, yeah. And you get an achievement for finishing each section. If I get all golds in Rookie, I'll get an achievement. Get all golds in the team battle one or whatever it was called. Get an achievement. There's like five or six achievements tied to scenario mode. And we'll be like, wow, it'll practically be rain in achievements. In 14th position is one of the Toro Rosso drivers who had a poor race start, but seems to be picking up the pace in these latter stages. He's definitely outperforming right now, but is it enough for a points finish? No, no. Maybe, maybe not. The car's really working for us this weekend. Use this to show the team that you have the ability. Get into the points. I gotta remember how to drive, though. I think I break too late. All right. I just started the data. I gotta get in the groove. A warm up. It's a little loud though. I'm gonna turn it down a bit. Don't mess too much vroom vroom in my ear, right? Ah. I probably shouldn't have done that. I probably disqualified me. I probably shouldn't have done that. He's it. Turn right to go left. Uh, oop, I used my flashback after the event. 
But I only have one flashback. Let's restart. Companies advertised might not even exist today. I'm pretty sure Rolex exists. Pretty sure they're still making watches. The hey, MO rate side all no. That sounds like an airplane company, if I had to guess. Never heard of those guys. Don't know what UBS is either. Lions? I don't know what that is. Maybe an Italian company, though? This is the track for Italy, so... It'd be funny if we got uh, region-specific advertising. Ah, I went over. Lions sounds sounds like it'd be like the Italian word for alliance or something. I don't know. I, I'm just guessing though. I have no clue. Yeah, I'm losing. I'm losing the thing because uh, he's getting farther away, not uh, closer. I've heard of Alliance. Me neither. I haven't heard of any of these companies except Rolex. Right now, we're just trying to remember how to drive the course and how to drive in general. How do I control my vehicle? It's been like a week since I last drove anything. I forgot how to play this game. You gotta warm up first. Break to low late there, but not super late. Four seconds to the next car. Push, push. Yeah, I'm starting to gain now. I went from five seconds to four. So I'm improving. Not gonna improve enough to get the medal this time. Uh -oh. Whoop. Mad cat. Fast and the furious is rough. Fast and the Furious if it was a sim racing game instead of an arcade racing game. Arcade racing games are much easier. You just go vroom vroom. There's like a drift button usually. And you drift around corners. You don't have any DRS. Ah! I didn't break enough. No DRS. No curves. That's the end of my... That's the end of my attempt. Ability. Get into the points. I'm getting to the points. That's not really a good one. They didn't penalize me with a corner cut though, because I was going so slow.
That might be a corner cut. No, nah, really? All right. I don't think I'm gonna get that. Ah. One more overtake puts you into the points. Give it everything you have. I managed not to lose control. Pretty messy, though. I don't think I'll catch up to 10th. He's too far. It's always the trying to catch up to certain position ones that are challenging. Much easier to defend when you're in front with the AI. But these guys have not succeeded in overtaking me, but trying to catch up is tough. Not gonna happen. I have to... It's like the last one where I have to be really efficient to catch up. a bit to get the last one too where I had to get the like 18th do, 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 do. not this time I've settled for 11th right and they're like no no gold medal for you 10th or nothing That's right. Darn. A poor start spelled what would be a dip. Shut up. Uh. Yeah, I'm not gonna. I keep pressing the wrong freaking button. I should press start. I keep pressing the back. Uh, I think we'll, 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 we'll redo that one. The car's really working for us this weekend. Could we stop uh, going off in the first corner, please? You always want me to push for the big finish. Rip. Look how much farther behind he's getting. This ain't gonna be the one either. Three laps 
to go. You have to be pretty, pretty good to get gold on these ones. I fucked up that first big round corner. I should already be past 13. I should be 13th right now. At least in my opinion. Oh well, all I can do is this weird thing called practicing. Never heard of that before. Trying to cut the corner too short. Wasted my first lap not even passing it anybody. Yeah, sure, I'm gonna get 10th this time. No, I'm not! Dude. Twitch TV streamer Prophelia, good news. Hello, Twitch TV viewer. Capital Dolby, what's what's this good news? Oh, now you punished me for corner cutting? Oh, okay, okay, okay. I cannot spell start soon with R -tings. What you deserve for free? Wow, amazing. Sell starting soon without our things, huh? I should get for free. That's probably disqualification. Yeah. Yeah, I get one flashback. If we pass them without getting ourselves disqualified, like we fuck up the corner and uh, get nothing. That penalty was going to be an ender, though. You're not getting it with a penalty. I had the flashback, but I only get one flashback for metal scenarios. Breaking too late. I'm definitely a very elegant, good racer and all that. Just playing it cautiously didn't uh, get me tent, so I tried to be more reckless now. I'm trying to do things as fast as possible. Nah, I keep making mistakes. No! Where'd they go? I don't know. Where did they go? Hmm, who knows? That's a good question.
corner cut. You've made it into the points. Incredible work. We knew you had it in you. Uh, pretty sure that warning for corner cutting is going to do me in. I overshot this one, too. Ah! I did not give you permission to do that. No! Get back here! You fucking piece of shit. I probably wasn't gonna get it anyway, but... You snuck up on me. You snuck up on me. Or, wait, whoa. Rest in peace. 100% free for me, are you sure? You guys don't seem to have to break too much for these. The car's really working for us this week. You guys don't seem to have to break too much for this. I find it suspicious. I get the points finish if I cheese that first corner. Need from you is one thing. Oh, what's that? I'm always trying to do this one too early. I'm good at doing this one too late. Ugh. Fuck off. I didn't say you could pass me. You didn't sneak up on me like Perez. You can fuck up. One thing it could be. Hmm. Hello? Hello! What's up? What's happening? How's it going? I hope your day is going better than my attempts to get a gold medal right now. We're into the final couple of I know it. Okay, excellent work so far. You're just two places outside of the points. We can do this. Not likely. Give me a quarter cut. No? I don't understand this, that corner in general.
Blech. I am very bad at this, uh... First card. I keep overshooting it. You give me a penalty, though? Or just a warning? There's a difference. It doesn't say I have a penalty on the left side, so. But. Am I so bad at this part? Oh, he's sneaking up. I guess that warning was just a warning. A late race push by the Toro Rosso driver meant that he was able to recover from a poor race start and was able to finish in the points. Wow. He did the thing. It's totally no cheese. M much cheese. Much cheese. Cheesy philia, right? <laughs> You're sitting, thinking, and waiting. Oh, what are you sitting, thinking, and waiting for, huh? Actually, you can't sit for something, can you? Uh, maybe sit for someone in a meeting. Thinking for somebody? Uh, I don't think you can do that either. I guess that only really applies to the waiting part. See what this last one is. Win the World Drivers' Championship in your rookie year. The last race of the season, you've been giving yourself the chance of winning the World's Drivers Championship in your rookie year. Unfortunately, the first part of the race didn't go as you and your or your team had planned, and you were back in seventh position. You have just over four laps left of the race to finish in second to give you enough points to win the championship. Why do you guys keep making the thing longer? This was four. That was four. This one's five. What are you people doing? What are you people doing? Ideas, of course. Ah, oh, I see. Waiting for ideas. Here's an idea. Maybe all the cars could just slow down and let me pass them. I like this idea. Just a few laps to go in the Brazilian Grand Prix, and the rookie McLaren driver needs a second place finish to win the World Drivers' uh, Championship. This one's going to take a bit because I'm not very familiar with this course. He's had such an amazing first season. This is the Brazil one, isn't it? I'm not very experienced with this course. It's usually the last one in the season challenge or career. I by that point, I have enough points for my achievement, so I haven't practiced this one to get really good at it. So I think this will take a bit. I'm in a different car every single time, too. Whee! I'm gonna have to practice the the track. Oh my gosh! Insanity. I feel we'll be here for a while. I think we got the Monza one somewhat quick because I only got a warner, warning for that quarter cutting. And I'm already pretty familiar with Monza. This one I'm not f that familiar with. Uh, so I'm not as confident. Excuse me. I will get second. I literally just bopped him out of the way. This is toward the end of the track, isn't it? Yes. 
Okay, only a few laps left now. If you can find your way into second place, then you'll be crowned the World Drivers' Champion. No fucking pressure there. Oops. I'm off the track there. I love vehicle. Wow, I might... The handling for this car is something. Gotta say, I preferred the last car. One feels easier to, uh... Fuck up. It's a pretty short track, isn't it? I better be. That's when I use my curves. I bet. I don't think I'll catch up to that guy. You have an idea? You taking notes about your idea? Well, are you gonna share your idea? Brum, brum, brum. That's right, Enigma. What's up? What's happening? How's it going? What? How you doing tonight? This is going to be like the other one I did where I didn't have any practice on the track. It's going to take a while, I guess, Phil. I keep breaking too early. Break it, break it too late. I just used a whole lap and didn't gain any distance on the guy in front of me. That tells me I'm not racing optimally. Which is a bit like a uh, no shit. Of course I'm not. I don't have very much practice on this track. So. What do you expect? I keep breaking too early there. And absolutely no distance on this guy at all, that lap. You can break later than you think you can on this one, it seems. Because it's so many curves. It's not super sharp corners like curves. curves. This one's a bit sharper. Ah, this one was sharper. Oh, that one was sharper too. Although. I'm not only not catching up to the guy in front of me, the guys behind me have caught up to me. <gasps> oh, no! Yeah, I think I might have to practice this track some. We're gonna have to get good at this track. We don't have hardly any practice on it. I've only ever, I've only ever dr just driven it. I've never had to practice it to uh, get first place or whatever like I did on a bunch of the other season challenge tracks. This one's always the last one of the season. By then I've already got my championship or whatever, so I just drive the truck. Not caring what position I get. Well, I haven't learned how to optimally drive this thing. Not that I learned how to optimally drive the other ones either, because, uh, yeah. Marbles? Who is playing marbles in the road? I definitely didn't go off the road, right? Nah, I mean, I'm a good driver. Oh, 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 
is still rich. Work on your next completion. Oh, that's cool! I'm doing some more grinding on this one. Gradually getting better at the game, I think. Maybe. In his inaugural season, the rookie McLaren driver has missed out on winning the World Drivers' Championship. Finishing in second place today was just too great a task. Can't believe this. Maybe I should go time trial this course for a while. Or I should just practice here. What's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? Overshot. Way overshot that one. Excuse me. Excuse me. Past the first guy, no problem. Everybody else, though? Ha 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 Okay, four laps left now. If you can find your way into second place, then you'll be crowned the world driver champion. Find my way into second place? You mean, uh, don't suck at the racing? Why you dot that thought in me, Dobie? What'd I do? Oh, that's exactly not. What we need. Push, push. Oh, my push, push just made me farther behind because I break too much. But you know. Ah, I break too little. breaking too early in my opinion anyway that one wasn't too bad i guess you only give me like four laps to move five places though three laps to go that's not the track that is grass that's grass the amount of time you said you don't know the track in the space of four laps. Well, um, I don't. What do you want me to say? Okay, if I slow down here, I'm gonna get through this curve. You want me to talk like I'm a car racing commentary announcer or something? Oh, she's gaining on that car in front of her. It's a tight race. But who's going to come out on top? Uh, overshot. Connect and update your Xbox 360 online. So you're able to track on 360 now. Ooh, that's cool! i play some cool 360 games. <gasps> We're into the final couple of laps. challenge seems to be getting the next guy all right now i'm not good enough at the track to get the next guy or to reliably catch up i was catching up there but then i lost him again 
I seem to be better at the final section of the track than the AI, but... Or at least the AI directly in front of me. I'm pretty sure they're designed to stay a certain distance and not zoom off into the sunset, though. Ah, come on, you piece of shit. Fuck off. That was totally just a baby corner cut. It's okay, guys. My car seems to be straight up faster because I catch up on the straight. Too bad I suck at everything else. My gosh, practice? What is that? Never heard of it. Practice in my video game. Ah, it's too early. Too early. Wow. We see... We, 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 we're close enough to see fifth place's nameplate. Wow. Wow. This is a safe bet. We'll be here for a while. <laughs> I might be here rest of stream, you know. Hope you guys like uh, watching me go around the same corners over and over for 12 hours, right? Uh, not that long. Overshot my first quarter. But I thought, Ooh! You're excited to watch me go around the... Uh, I forgot what this place is called. This is Brazil, though. Sao Paulo or something. That is not how you race, pro. You don't go scree! Unless you're playing Need for Speed. Then you do go scree. It depends on the game. In this game, no scree is good. There's no drifting required, therefore no scree. Lap times are looking good. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We're faster than the car ahead in sector three. See if we can use that to our advantage. Right, only four laps remain. You need second place if you want to be the world driver's champion today. You're just gonna dot dot me no matter what. I could win and get first and you'd still dot 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 me. I'd still be like, could have gotten zero with place. Totally, totally. Ah, there. Three laps to go. Three laps to not catch up and pass five. Okay. We've only got a few laps left to pass this guy, so if you're going to do it, it needs to be soon. I mean, I'm not good enough to even pass five right now, much less four, three, or two, so... 
I think you got your expectations too high, Mr. Announcer. Whatever you are, I don't know. What do they call the- what do they call the guy who talks to the racer? I don't know. Assistance? I don't know. I don't know what it's called. I'm trying to tell him he's got his expectations set too high right now. He needs to come back in at least a half hour. Maybe then I can get third. Two laps remaining. Two laps until the end of the race. Love that. Now I got farther away. Rest in peace. Oh, yeah. That's not really how you do it, bro. I passed him for 0.5 seconds, therefore I'm improving. Air Raider? Nah, the, <coughs> the guy in like the announce- the, who talks to the driver, it wouldn't be an air ray tour. It'd be something else. A bouncer, helper, pit crew, something. I can't believe I passed five. I've now made it to fifth. So I'm improving now. See that? Good enough, I'll get good enough. I can get fourth. And then third, and then second. Gotta practice. It's much tougher to catch up to uh, these cars than it is to defend once you're in front of them, though. I'm pretty sure I start at three by default, right? Yeah. I got fifth now! That's an improvement! I'm 13 fastest lap. I'll call that improvement. Dot, dot, dot. You're the one who signed up to watch me and practice a bunch, right? I don't know how you survived the season challenge. I don't think that's how you cut a corner. That's how you cut a corner without getting a corner cutting penalty, apparently. He's trying to block me. Not rude. I can't believe this man. Okay, only a few laps left now. If you can find your way into second place, then you'll be crowned the world driver's champion. Oh that.
There's only one thing you signed up for? Oh. Okay. Just think, someday we'll get the final achievement in this game. In like, uh, October or something. Won't it be exciting? That's not how you do that corner. That's pretty good one of that corner, though. You're faster than the car ahead in sector three. Try to pass it. Good pace. Keep pushing. Three laps to go. A few laps left to pass this guy, so if you're going to do it, it needs to be soon. A few laps left to pass this guy? What about all the other guys? Think I'm going to pass everybody on the same lap? Seems unlikely. Unless they were all crowded together, I guess. Seems unlikely again, though. Well, you've taken some slight damage to the front wing. You should be okay to stay out. We're into the final couple of laps. Oh, my turn radius. Uh oh. Life with a. Or, but that's got a damaged front wing. I'm pretty sure the turn radius is worse now. And probably some other stuff. Ah! Can I get close enough to fourth? Rest in peace. Pretty sure I need to be behind like third at this time. It's been too long trying just trying to pass fifth. I think that's how you do a corner. Just a guess. There's only one thing you signed up for. Uh, I have to tell you the truth. I don't have any cookies. 
Or biscuits. None. Rest in peace. Ah, what the- Oh, that was terribly tragic. We keep overshooting the first fucking corner. Unacceptable. It's only marginally better. But not really. I didn't do that. Nothing happened. Yeah, that first corner is very important to get right. If I overshoot it, then uh, I spend the rest of my race just trying to catch up. And since I did it well this time, fifth is already right here. I'll fuck it up, the Goodbye, Fist. We'll miss you. What's going on? What's going on? That is not how you do that. What do I have? What do you mean? No biscuits, no cookies. Trying to be greedy and take my ice cream? Yeah, to have it. My ice cream. I'm driving terribly because I'm trying to push the limits of how fast I can go. I'm trying to figure out how fast I can go, then it's like. Blah, 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 blah. I'm pretty sure I have to have passed fifth by the end of this lap. Good pace. Carry on with the job you're doing. Well, what else are you going to tell me? Get better, Lusor? Obviously not. Three laps to go. I keep fucking this up and then he runs away. Instead of passing him there, I fuck it up. And then he gets away from me. Definitely not doing that section very well. I'm not gaining on the AI at that section. They're just pulling farther away. Corner is pretty much the only time I get any chance. laps to catch up and get fourth for the first time. Oh, what the fuck? What happened? Why did I lose control? I already used my flashback. GG. What happened? I've never lost control there before. Ah, uh, Biscuits, what do I have? Pronus. You'll have to settle for Pronus. Proness, what you're seeing right now. Oh, 
Quarter cutting. You quarter cutting little bitch. They say. Quarter quarter cutting. I get a penalty now. No. Oh. You don't see anything? Oh, well, I guess I forgot to turn on the game. That's okay. You weren't missing anything anyway. That might be a penalty. We'll see, we'll see. Oops, I break too early. Nah, I fucked up. I got away. I guess the guy behind me is angry. Massa. Massa. Can't let this guy hold us up much longer. We need you to pass him. Massa. Oh, man, really? I caused a collision. No pressure there, huh? I didn't get penalized for causing a collision, though, apparently. Which is really weird. I don't know how I feel about that. If I was determined to be the cause, why wouldn't I get penalized for it? I can see that too. This is your final lap and last chance to take second. Make the World Driver Championship yours. Well, will I get penalized now? No? Not obviously, anyway. Maybe a hidden penalty. Maybe the secret penalties like in Season Challenge.
We'll see. Otherwise, that's GG. I didn't get any penalties. We'll see. Looks like I didn't get a penalty. Because it would tell me right there. Second place was an ambitious goal for the McLaren driver, but he's really delivered today. The reward for such a drive, the World Drivers' Championship. Woohoo! We did it! We did it! We did it! Way faster than I thought we were gonna do it. I thought I was gonna be here for two or three hours. Hey, Pyro! What's up? What's happening? How's it going? You can see Felia, but where's Pro? You're not cool enough to see or understand proness. Now, you see here, young man. What you see now is a pro. A pro! A pro! Understand? Look at my shiny gold there. Wow, it's right there. Wow! It's so cool! You're jealous of my shiny gold medal, aren't you? Did you get it? I did! We just got our shiny gold medal. And finished this scenario. Rookies and cream achievement unlocked! <gasps> it's forgetting all the gold medals in the rookie scenario mode. All those cool gold medals. Woo! Woo! I'm being excited. Well, uh, next up is a teammate battle, apparently. Oh, man. I guess I gotta beat my teammate. Oh, boy. You weren't ready? You weren't ready? For what? Uh, what do you need to be ready for? What do you need to be ready for, young man? What, what do you need to be ready for? You weren't ready for me to get that gold medal? I understand. You weren't ready for that. Nothing? Hmm. 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 Whee! I'm just pressing buttons crazily now. I'm just having fun there. Finish ahead of your teammates. Montreal. Which track is this? I don't know if I've done Montreal. Hmm. Is this Canada? I'm, I think maybe I've done Canada. I haven't. Don't think I've done Canada in a while though. I think that's only in a uh, rear. It's been an even fight between you and your Caterham teammates so far this season. Ew, Caterham. I hate driving Caterham. Going back to a worse car again. With each of you outracing the other three times, can you take the advantage in the teammate battle in today's race by finishing ahead? Can you can you take the thing that by uh, finishing ahead? Should, that sounds like it should be a question mark. So it's like, can you? So it's asking, right? But there's no question mark. We got F12 that. F12! Finish ahead of Charles Pick to be ahead of him in the teammate battle. He made 15th, so I have to get to 15th. Not sure what Montreal is. I think that's a place in Camel Camel Mondal, Mooseland. A place with igloos everywhere, right? Holy, holy. Rose a Joker. Me, a Joker. I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm totally super serious all the time. No, I'm not. I Dray. Oh, okay. Left of the Canadian Grand Prix, and the Caterham's number two driver is looking for a strong finish to the race. He could soon be challenging his teammate for position. It is Canada. I think was Canada in season challenge? I'm not sure. I don't think it was. 
You uh, whoa, what the fuck? What, you okay? Oh, I fucking hate this car. Oh, the handling. Double hydration, that's right. Oh. It's gonna take me a bit just to get used to the car handling again. I don't know. I don't know when to use curves for this one. We'll figure it out. Uh, that's not how you drive. That's not typically how you drive a vehicle, pro. You don't drive them to the wall. Oh, little chicane here. What's wrong with it? I don't know. Whatever the stuff over there is, right? Uh. It's the middle thing there. The thing that's yellow there. Exciting. Yeah, I don't have much experience with Canada either. This might take a bit too, we'll see. Will it take as long as it took with Brazil? I don't know. I didn't take as long with Brazil as I expected to. I got that much faster than I thought I would. Oh, that's a sharp one. Did I just do a whole lap? With current strategy, we have an excellent chance to challenge your teammate today. Let's get past show. Are you crazy, man? With our current strategy, we have an excellent chance. Are you crazy? I didn't even use my curves because I hadn't even realized I went to a new lap and got more curves. That's how much attention I am paying. Yeah, that ain't happening. I'm not gating 12 seconds. Right now we're just learning how to drive Canada's track, okay? Right now we're just learning how to drive it. What is this blue car? Wait, what happened? Okay, we need you to make way for the car behind. Oh, we get lapped. Well, he's not catching up, though. He can't tell me to allow a faster car to pass. But I see no reason to slow down. If he's faster, he'll catch up to me and pass me on his own. Doesn't need my help. Is this the faster car? Maybe. Oh, I didn't break the... This is the start of the track, isn't it? This one's got a lot of sharp curves. When should I use my cars? Should we use it here? Most different between this car from the others you don't like. This one has worse handling because it's an inferior car. Caterham and Marussia are the two worst cars in this game in terms of handling and control or whatever. Though so you don't turn quite as easily. There's a lot of trees. Yeah, trees. Trees are cool. Who doesn't like trees? 
Very long straight here. And a chicane. And DRS. But that's useless in a race. And fetish law. Magnificent! <laughs> I got one position there. Or did I start 18th? I think I started 19th, didn't I? I don't know. 17 seconds. Strategies just wasn't enough to tip the scales in the Caterham teammate battle today. With a few laps left, the Caterham driver couldn't find the advantage, so remains behind his teammate. Well, you see, you see, announcer, there's two problems here. There's one, I'm in a Caterham vehicle. Two, I don't know this track very well. The next one might go better because that's Nurburgring, and that's uh, that was the season challenge one. But it's probably been so long I forgot it, right? <laughs> Rest in peace to that vehicle right there. This is a challenge race. This is a scenario mode. So, oh, in scenario mode, you have, like, various, well, scenarios, right? In the category I'm in, this is a teammate challenge, so I have to finish ahead of my teammate. The last one I just did, I had to get from 7th place to 2nd place. It's a different, different challenge for each uh, race. Well, that super sharp. If I finished in first, uh, presuming I hacked the game somehow to finish in first from 18th place, uh, I guess that'd be good. I would still be ahead of my teammate, so that's not happening unless all the AI just spontaneously die. So, unless they all just suddenly go. This one's super sharp. What the fuck? Whoa, 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 whoa. I for keep forgetting about that one being there. Whee! What? Did you not? Did you not do that? What the teammate think about this? Well, he's a bunch of zeros and ones, so I doubt he cares. I doubt he has much of an opinion. Gap is currently seven seconds between you and the car ahead. That's not too good, is it? I'm not sure that's how you're supposed to go through a chicane, but uh, <laughs> it didn't corner cut penalty me, so remaining. Your objective is to finish ahead of Char. Char. I guess I could maybe do that, but I don't know. It sounds like a tall or door. This lap, or this uh, track's pretty short, isn't it? Not that long a track. Did you not lose control, please? Little baby chicane there, too. It's ba this track's basically got two. a little too late, I think.
gaps 11 socket? Oh, wait. So the gap's getting worse, or the guy was talking about the guy in front of me and not my teammate? I'm definitely not doing this one very well. I want to practice this one for a while. I'm always on rich. Seems to be a default. Everybody seems far away. I definitely have to drive this much better. Although I don't feel like I did that bad, but uh, I'm so far behind, so I'm obviously doing terrible. I'm not doing it fast enough to be gaining. There's <laughs> last chapter, Rox zero zero deaths. Good! No spoilers! Say no more! What? Feel bad for that first guy. He was obviously having engine troubles. Corner cut. Oh, not corner cut that time? Okay. All right. No corner cut there, really. I'm so far behind everybody else. How the hell do I catch up? Drive well enough that I catch up is the obvious answer, but still. Feels like they're eons ahead of me. They're not, but still. Ah, overshot this one. Five seconds is an eternity in a race. First time I died in Yakuza Zero, uh, probably the first boss fight. Pretty sure I died to the Kuze in the beginning. And then I had to redo that section. I was like, ah! Or maybe I died to the chair guy. Maybe the big there's a big guy with like a chair or something in the first section, right? I think I died to him. Because I didn't know to do the like special attack thing. I already forgot what they're called. Takedowns? Well, I'm not doing very good at catching up to my uh, fellow racers, am I? Like they're eons ahead of me. Seven seconds is all that separates you and the car ahead. 
Oh, so I've lo gone down two seconds. I was five seconds before, now I'm seven. So I'm getting worse. Oh no, whatever will I do? Other than practice, I guess. I don't know. Hey, Mexican boy, what's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? Hope you're doing well. My weekend was pretty good. I had a very nice weekend, and I'm uh, overshot. This first corner is super sharp. It's deceptively sharp. You think it's uh, not as sharp as it actually is. I'm feeling I'll be here for a while. I don't know if this track is tough or it's just the car and I'm doomed. Wow. So far I've not been able to even catch up to him. Much less pass him. Woo! Here's your first chapter beat Lieutenant to go to a building. What? I can't believe he didn't die to the boss or the big chair guy. A superior strategy just wasn't enough to tip the scales in the Caterham team. What superior strategy? You were playing on hard, though. Psh. I think I played on normal. I usually do all my first playthroughs on normal. Do, 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 do. We need to pass this guy. You're much faster in sector one. I am. They don't start out that far ahead, do they? I just lose because I'm slower than them. Yeah, I actually see them. Holy shit. I can't believe I didn't get penalized for that. Ugh. Maybe I'll get penalized for this. Ah! You guys are weird. Game weird. Okay. Well, hard to look at chat for this track because there's not big long straight. Wait, there's one coming up. Driving is optional anyway. I only pay attention to my driving skills. You're excited your B day is only two months away. Might sound like a bit of time. Ah, oh, that flies by, man. Time just flies. Before you know it, it'll be Christmas time again. You'll be like, what happened? Oop, forgot to use curves. You're gaining on Chilton by around three seconds a lap. I am... That's good. Seems like the beginning is the most important part in determining if I can catch up or not. Okay, that one's a corner cut, but the other one wasn't. I think it's all based upon how fast you're going. Try and close the gap to the car ahead. It's currently two seconds. 
I'll learn how to drive this track more recklessly. You can only catch up to people if you're reckless, it seems. That's what it feels like to me. Break at the last possible second. Accelerate! Oh, I overshot that one. I did better at actually catching up to I forgot to use my curse. I did better at catching up to him this time. We gotta pass them though. I'll work on the passing them part. Overshot. We only got to pass three cars. The tough part is ca catching up to them in the first place. Not gonna happen this run. But I got see a noticeable improvement, so. You want to be careful there. Hmm. If you uh, do, do that wrong, you end up on that green uh, lattice part and you slow down tremendously. But you still don't get punished for uh, going too slow or corner cutting. My dad for the Kuze boss fight even more the continuous fights in the Tojo office. Ah uh. Not very good there. Do, do, do. I feel like the very first section is the most important part, and if I don't do it very well, I have no chance of catching up. It's gonna be a quarter cut. Like, they're gone, man. I feel like if I don't do this part well, I don't have any chance to catch up. Yeah. Can you say your birthday is June 12th? Yeah? Wait, who wants to know? Uh, who wants to know? I actually didn't die on the sofa guy, the enemy, next enemy that got me. Okay, well, I pr he pr the sofa guy probably took out 90% of my HP, right? Because it's also your birthday? Yeah, you've said that. I still remember. Poor guy right here. I feel bad for this guy who's got engine troubles or whatever's going on. I'm just checking! You were, huh? Raffle teas! Are you sure? <laughs> what? Overshot. Off they go. Hmm. Hmm. How close? How 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 close should I fuck it up for like? Oh, that's corner cut. Interesting. 
Only because it didn't slow me down dramatically. That's the only reason why you are unhappy about it, gang. I break too late. Three seconds is the gap to you in the next car. Three seconds. It's not too bad, but I'm pretty sure it just became five seconds. It was me overshooting that uh, corner. Like to note the first time you die in a video game. Ah. I don't typically remember that. Uh, well, making a comeback from that. One where I literally took one step and fell to your death. Ha! I pretty much did that in Dark Souls 2. If I recall, I think my first death was in the tutorial section because they changed what the jump button was from Dark Souls 1 to Dark Souls 2. So I pressed what I thought was the jump button. And then I found out it wasn't. I was like, oops. You get an achievement for dying your first time in that game. Chilton's ahead. Five seconds between you two. I don't know if there's invisible walls preventing you from falling. There wasn't. <laughs> I've done that in games like Bastion. I was like, hey, can I just jump off? And you can. You can just jump off. But, uh... In that game, uh... They don't kill you. They just respawn you back on the platform. Which I was super disappointed about. I wanted to die a horrible death. Stop corner cutting me. That was that was not a corner cut. That was a corner slide. Totally different. I think I'm doing well enough to gain reliably this time around. We will see. Uh... Oh yeah, gotta use my curse. Great pace in sector three. You're the fastest car in the final sector. That's because I fucking cheat the chicane. Not because I'm good. Ah, overshot. If I was doing well at that corner, that is, and I'd be in front of this guy right now, but... I'm not good at that corner. I overestimate. Well, apparently I don't have to break as much as I think I do for there, because he did not break very much. Interesting. I've been over-breaking there. Corner cut, corner cut, corner cut. Ah, okay. At least I actually finally got in front of uh, somebody. I know. Progress! I say, is this guy's trying to pass me with the DRS? <laughs> I mean, if you're not going to penalize me for corner cutting, why wouldn't I corner cut? Driving like a maniac.
Morning, quarter cut. Oh, I think I finally got penalized. I saw I saw a different symbol there. Yeah, penalty times one. Rest in peace. I finally corner cut too many times, and they were like, no. I'm not like fucking four corner cuts to get that. So easy to corner cut on this track, though. I'm so tempted. I don't think that's gonna go well. Uh, let's just restart. There's a way to get through that chicane without getting corner cut penalty, but you have to be angling it just right. Outside of being Brazil, there usually isn't multiplayer games with local servers. Oh man. You have to deal with higher ping then. I always play with high ping, do you know a way around? I'm afraid I do not. I don't know much about ping and stuff. Well, uh, it was no corner cut warning, but that was pretty uh, rough steer there. That's gonna be a corner cut. Yeah. Hard not to corner cut that. Well, at the speed I'm going anyway. The obvious answer is just slow down. I'd be like, slow down insanity. I'm not driving so uh, as well this time. I don't think I'm gonna catch up. I'll still try the. Oh, I keep forgetting to use my curves in the second half here. Maybe I should. Maybe I should use it somewhere else. Cause I can't seem to remember to use it at the end. There we go. I slowed down more. You happy game? What we'll do here. Oh shit. Fucking break too late.
What's even the point of curse? It doesn't give me that, that big a boost. Where's my need for speed nitro? Come on now. Damn it. Wait, I didn't get the... Oh, there's my penalty. <laughs> the timer disappeared, so I thought my penalty was done. I thought that... What, Toby? What? I'm a big zoom zoom. Very good at racing pro, as you can see. Very fast, very wow. Me? Oh. I feel honored. To earn the prestigious dot dot dot. cut too fast the balance between too fast and not fast enough that's gonna be a corner cut to oh, wait no okay fine Maybe, but I don't think I have enough laps to do it now. God damn it. I didn't want to cut quite that sharp. You're gaining on Chilton by around three seconds a lap. It's good to know. That wasn't illegal, really? That surprised me. How much I lost by sliding there? It's so sad. Ooh. Yeah! Rip. Yep. Overshot. Very important to not overshoot this one. How dare you be faster than me? You're Marussia. Get in the fucking back. Ah, oh, shit.
Hello, man. What's up? I'm aware of that. Incredible, you've managed to clean pass. Hold on to this position. <laughs> you managed to clean pass. You didn't fuck up, is basically all I just heard. That's so bad. I should be offended. Did we know what? Why? Didn't get too many f warnings. A superior strategy decided the teammate battle for Caterham. With just a few laps left, the Caterham driver was able to catch and then pass his teammate. Yeah! We did it! We showed him who was in charge around here. Aren't we cool? Aren't we awesome? Aren't we amazing? That's right. We are very cool. No? Are you gonna say that when I get my final achievement and finish this game eventually? You still say no? Congratulations, you've unlocked the next scenario group. Cool, but I'm still gonna do them in order, so. You put sunglasses on them, yes. I see. Oh no, the next one's called Rain Man. You know what that means. That means it's gonna be raining. Finish ahead of your teammates. Okay. Gold class. Finish ahead of your teammates in wet weather conditions. Oh, that's eight positions? What the fuck? Like, this one was five, three, right? I only have to go three positions. Now I have to do eight in the rain? Are the AIs known to be better in the rain? I think this game just hates me. Your teammate, Jean Eric Verde, I probably mispronounced that. My apologies. Has been considered a better driver in the wet. With today's race expected to be heavy rain throughout this, is your opportunity to show the team that you can also handle the tricky conditions. You've struggled a little in qualifying and are sitting in 18th position while jean Eric has sat in 10th. You know that in heavy rain conditions, anything can happen. Can you beat your teammate in a wet weather race? Nope. Well, let me stretch my hands first. Ah! Ruffle cool. Are you excited about this wet weather? Wet weather? Wet weather? Wet weather? I like how there's two guys with the same score, but they're one and two. They should both be one. They got the same fucking score. Second place guy feels robbed, man. To beat you in any race? I have absolutely no doubt about that. You're better at racing games than I am. I have zero doubt about this. I think the wet's from snow. That'd be pretty cool if there was snow weather in this game. It's only clear or raining, though. Imagine if it had snow weather effects. Maybe some of the newer ones do. Or maybe they just cancel races if there's snow and don't bother. I wouldn't think so, though. You wouldn't cancel for rain. Maybe heavy snow, but light snow I think you'd still be good with. I don't think they race in the snow. That'd be no fun! <laughs> no fun! Imagining it right now. 
Well, let's go suck. Which control course is it again? Oh, it's Germany, right? Uh, it's Germany in the rain. We go hide. I have to gain eight positions. Either I'm given a lot of laps to do it, or people go sliding away from the course and give me a few positions or something. Ava. It feels like a lot to do in like three or four laps. Happened today with a track this wet, so Jean Eric Verne may be feeling confident, sat so far ahead of his teammate. But these conditions can create the unexpected. <gasps> yeah, I don't think the unexpected is going to happen. I think these guys got it. Let's get past John Eric today. The Hamilton 16th? Okay, now I know this is just a scenario, not reality. I cannot fucking see, man. I can't fucking see. You've taken some slight damage to the front wing. I could not see. I could not see. Okay, that first corner is gonna allow me to get in front right there. I could not fucking see though. That's why I hit that guy. I hit whoever was in front of me. I couldn't fucking see. I'm sure it was deliberate, too. Yeah, they're clouding me up again. Can't fucking see, man. Wow. Penalty. Can't see! I can see better than that in the season challenge in scenario mode. This has got to be deliberate. You're imaging it right now? Alright, you image it as much as you want. It'll be like that, right? Rip. I mean, you didn't see anything. Wow. The turn radius is dog shit. That's because it's wet, though, right? Not the car, right? So Hamilton's an environmentalist, climate change and all that. Let's stop and project across the world to race, though. What? Well, um, uh, it's okay as long as it's not um, uh, yourself that has to do anything, right? Yeah, I, can I need to start breaking earlier. The track, I swear. I'm pretty sure it's the track. This is the Red Bull, maybe Infinity car? It's a Red Bull car. This one should have better handling than the last one I was doing. I'm pretty sure it's the wet track. This, the trying to stop is really slow. That move was illegal. Return. I'll be, uh, wrong button. We could literally just restart until we do it without any penalty. No legal. Let's get past John Eric today. The wet weather All I have to do is get past him in this fucking corner and then just stay ahead the rest of the race. Wait, there's four laps? It's just like a regular race? Interesting. Fucking bitch. I was pretty so much a Lego. Thanks, teammate. I think that was my teammate anyway. I think he spun me up. He's like, we're going down together!
Wow. Okay, th this is wet, all right. This handling is something. Wow, what the fuck? Ugh. Wow. The handling in this weather is crazy. I don't think the wet races in the season challenge were this tough to handle. I was in a pretty good car, though. Ugh. Oh fuck. It definitely feels really easy to slide. I just have to drive carefully at this point and I'll be fine. Not likely my posi my teammate's gonna get way up ahead of me here. Ow, this handling. Ugh. The handling. I think you guys could try if you want, but I don't think you guys want to try. This is it's crazy. I wonder if they have some extra stuff turned on, like extra slippery turned on. None of the wet races I did in the season challenge were this hard to control. That's crazy. This is probably more realistic, though. I don't envy dr people driving in the rain like this, or the racers. This is a bitch. Ugh. I see some night maps. Or, uh, not with my peripheral vision. I don't, I, I kill off time to look at you. Well, this private jet became vegan. Wow. Yeah, that definitely sounds like, um, Let me try and do, man. Let me try and do, man. Let me try that. That's right. That definitely sounds like uh, the way to sh stick it to them. Almost sl spun out of control there. This guy's faster than me. This ain't my teammate though, so I don't really care. Ugh. This is a bitch, man. Feels like I can't really go fast at all. <clears throat> now be very careful coming out of corners, too. Accelerate too much, it'll be like, Wee! Welcome back, dude. Oh, we got a few different cars here. I had like two cars coming up on me there.
Alright. One more lap of this nonsense. Glad in. When did I pick marbles? I was on the track. When did I do that? I was like, ah, you went off the edge slightly here. Blah, blah, blah. Well, almost spun out there. do that very well. But I didn't get corner cut penalty. Or fall super far behind. So. I'm sick. Woohoo! This one's a pass in the first corner and then just stay ahead the rest of the race. Holy god, the tracking though. The handling. John Eric Verne was thought to be the better driver in these conditions, but his teammate really surprised us all to finish ahead. I mean, all that happened was everybody slowed down a bunch in the first corner. I was like, bye, bitches! You don't like Red Bull, but you're still drinking because of caffeine. No! No, cease the Red Bulls! They're not good for your health. Thanks. Thanks. Hold it. I'm taking you down with me. Oh yeah, when when my teammate spun me out, it was ridiculous. There's no hypocrite that reaped all the benefits first and tells everybody else to stop. How'd that work? Da -da -da. What? What are you that? Da -da? Oh, with that, that, that on. Ugh. At least all, the other three here say clear. Next one's India. I don't know if I have any practice on that one. Suzuka, I do have practice on. That's one of the. It was like the eighth track, right? In a uh, season challenge. And then we have Brazil again. Why is Brazil always last? It's like a tradition. Finish it. Stay ahead of your teammates whilst nursing an engine issue. Uh, uh, uh. Well, been nice to you guys. I only have to get three positions, but I apparently have an engine issue. Whatever that means. Uh, I have zero experience driving with an engine issue in this game. This could be interesting. You are sat in sixth place and everything is seemingly going well. You're in the last few laps of the race, but your car starts to exhibit a strange noise. On talking to your race engineer, it seems that you have engine problems and your car will definitely be slower over the next few laps. Can you drive the car cleanly over the next few laps? No. Can you stay ahead of your teammate while carrying an engine issue? No. Oh, wait. I start ahead of my teammate already. I started sixth. Hmm. So if I just have to defend, maybe?
But I have a feeling this engine issue is gonna be like. I don't know. I guess we'll see if the handling changes or whatever. Just sitting and thinking. Oh, okay. You sit and think. Very calm, peaceful, and relaxing. Ah. The Force India driver has driven a pretty fast race today, but we're now starting to see his times drop. It looks like he's got an issue with the car. Can he hold on over these final laps? I don't know, can I? Probably not. <clears throat> About what to do? Oh. Is that so? I think I'm not familiar with this track either. We're noticing a drop in performance from the engine. It doesn't look terminal, but we're going to ask that you take it steady with the car. You'll likely drop down the field, but try to stay ahead of Adrian. They just hit me! And spun me out! How did I cause a collision? They hit me! I didn't fucking cause the collision! That's bullshit. Oh, is it this track? This track looks kind of familiar. We're into the final couple of laps. We're noticing a drop in performance from the engine. It doesn't look terminal, but we're going to... I keep overshooting. I think maybe I did this track in Season Challenge. It looks kind of familiar. It's bad news. There's a significant issue with the engine. Performance will be affected. Nurse the car to the finish ahead of Adrian and show the team that you're the better driver no matter what the situation. Ha! No matter what the situation, I am the superior driver. It does sound like it's going. Blah, 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 oh yeah, I recognize this track. I do not have much practice on it, though. It's the it's the ninth one after Suzuka, but before Brazil. Do, 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 do. Well, I'm gonna bully you guys, but I'd already had the uh, achievements by this point, so I didn't practice this one too much either. Oh, it ends on troubles. I gotta say, I'm not really noticing a difference in handling or anything. It's just my speed is garbage. You're a dummy. What are you hitting me for? Why are you hitting me, huh? Why are you hitting me, huh? Uh-oh. My teammate's the one behind me now. Uh-oh. What does that mean? You're actually gonna penalize me for trying to block? How dare you even st think about it? What?
Everybody's like, hey, hey, hey. They're all hovering around me. Disaster struck when one of the Force India drivers received what looked to be a severe engine problem. Amazingly, however, the driver was able to bring the car home ahead of his teammate. Amazing indeed. Mind the guys or girls? <coughs> Why you want to know? Why are you asking? Let me think about this, Chloe. How how is this relevant to video gaming? Just curious. <gasps> You're a cat. Cheat? Mm, yes. I'm a cheat dildo. I blocked everybody. I didn't let anybody pass me. Not my teammate and not anybody else. Stay ahead of your teammates whilst nursing an engine issue. I got 11,000, Tom. Wait, what did I get to? Ahead of your teammates in... I'm going to get an 11,000, 12,000. Stay ahead of you. Recover from a puncture by overtaking your teammates. Wait, but I'm already ahead. I start at five, overtake your teammate. Competition has been fierce with your teammate all season as you each vie to prove your superiority into the latter stages at Suzuka. And you and your teammate are in fifth and sixth place on worn tires. As you overtake, you catch your right tire on his front wing, <gasps> causing you to have a puncture. Luckily, you are close to the pits and going for fresh, er, for new tires. You've lost a lot of time, but you have a fresh set of tires to catch and overtake your teammate. Can you recover from a puncture and overtake your teammate? This is kind of similar to that other one. Where I had to, re to go into pit to replace my front wing and then catch up like four positions. Depends on if the protagonist is male or female. That counts. <laughs> I think you never played Nier Automata. What? The best game ever? Well, actually, probably not really. I'm biased. Nier Automata is a pretty good game, though. Missed out on a cool story. You should play it sometime. To be. To be or not to be. I play that game. You haven't played it either? I played it a few years ago. 10 out of 10. I'm full stay. If they play near it would be totally because of the plot. That's right. It's got a very deep, well flashed, fleshed out plot. That's right. That's right. I wonder if we have to drive to the pit like the other challenge, too. So that's right. That's right. Bronze medals, one, two. Hmm, that would be when I didn't understand what gold was. I was like, achievement needs to be gold. Give me gold. It looks like the two Mercedes drivers have had a coming together, and Hamilton's teammate has come off worse with a puncture. Hold on, the car's right by the pits. He may still be able to get something out of this race. Game on! Whoa. Lovely weather we're having, full moon now. Oh, that sounds cool. I do have to drive to the pit. How dare you? At least the pit's right there this time. Rest in peace, this tire. I have three laps. The track is clear. Track is clear. My teammate sabotaged me. This should be criminal. Before the incident, your pace was good. Your objective remains the same. Use these new tires to catch and pass Lewis. Suzuka Drive is definitely interesting. My season challenge practice on this is wet. Next, 
five seconds separate you. I don't have to break quite as early here. Because it's draw. You're weird, Straber. Yes. Glad you finally noticed after all these years. I didn't deliberately knock him into the marbles or anything. He just went there, okay? It's his fault. He should have driven better. Teammate, this time's Hamilton. Wonder if they'll give him typical Hamilton AI. Two laps remaining. Two laps until the end of the race. I got six seconds. I don't think I'm catching up to him, man. Bit of a different beast when it's dry, man. corner cut apparently not cool enough
close to Lewis, so let's get past him. I doubt that. I'll try though. think that's gonna count that somehow counted I'm gonna cheat again I'm gonna cheat again <laughs> Fantastic drive saw Hamilton's teammate recover from a puncture and then regain the position he'd lost to Lewis. Only because I was going slow enough that I didn't get a penalty for cutting that. I think Pro doesn't play a lot of games feel protagonist. I mean, if I have a choice, I always pick the woman. Because, if you hadn't noticed, I am a woman! Rah! Bet you never noticed. There's plenty of games I've played though where you don't get a choice. You just play insert whoever character. I don't have an issue with that either. Isn't they'll be my number one fan? No! Number one critic! Please. How many years have I been streaming? I've been streaming since 2012. So 12 years this summer. This uh, I don't remember what day. It was August though when I first started in 2012. So when it's August, it'll be 12 years. Streaming on Twitch. Alright, cool, huh? It's gotta work plots what Pro was interested in, not Kratos fighting bear tested. I gotta say, Kratos is not really my cup of tea. He's so angry. He's so angry. I'm like, dude needs to chill. Got back to scroll up. You're asking for your bed web. Now you're wondering. No! Top secret information! Doesn't matter. Thought I was an iguana? God damn it. Thought you were Chloe controlling a human. Chloe wishes, don't you, cat? Don't you, cat? Point 12, you're a veteran. That's awesome. You've seen some shit. <gasps> I've been around quite a few Twitch changes and updates, yes. Where are you going, cat? She, she heard what I said, and then uh, she's, uh, she, she's leaving. She's walking away. Congratulations, you've unlocked the next scenario group. Hooray! I mean, Kratos is pretty chill if you know him. I mean, I've only played God of War 1, the first original one, from like 2005. And I've only played God of War 2 and God of War Betrayal. So I haven't played any of the newer ones or whatever. I've only played the three oldest ones in the series so far. Next one I do is going to be uh one of the PSP ones that's on PS3. I forget which one. Whichever one's next in the release order. I have to double check first. I've only played a few of them. For what I've seen in the old older ones, he's just angry all the time. He he he's got a good reason to be mad, I guess, in the second game. But he's just a stupid idiot in the first one. It is like I used to be tuber then. Nah, I only started VTubing uh when did I start? Was it 2022? Maybe? I think the first game I used a VTuber model for was when I did Wally. -E. I think that was the first one. And the first one with this model was uh, Infernax! 
like February last year, I think. Wally, yeah, I like the movie, the Pixar movie. Wally, like the Pixar, but yeah, I played Wally. Give chiropractors lessons to Gorgons all the time. Wait, what? Yeah, uh, yeah, that's what Kratos is doing. Uh, I guess that's true. Next game's God of War two. Oh, I've done God of War two. I've done God of War one. I've done God of War two, and I did the mobile game God of War Betrayal. Can you start out with just your voice and no VTuber? That's right. I was just voice only from like 2012 until like the first uh, the Wally game. The worst thing I ever did. The VTuber thing? I know, right? It's the worst thing ever. How will you ever survive? I, if only there was something I could do to, to change your mind. It's too bad. Nothing I could do to change your mind, right? Right. Next game's Chain of Olympus. Oh, that's the next one. That'll be the next one I do in the series. Though. I think uh, I've been doing them in release order. Instead of like story order. So it'd be Chain of Olympus and God of War 3 and then the other PSP one. Ghost of Sparta, I think. And then the newer ones, I think. Which Freela Laura? You gotta fill us in. What? So, so Delby first appeared in like 2014, 2015, something like that. When I was playing Batman Arkham City. Didn't do that with Yaxa. Nope, Yaxa is gonna be in the uh, story order. <laughs> Should I have started with zero? Even though zero is like. Wow, I got 8,500. I got top 10k on the leaderboard. What? Zero is like the fourth or fifth game, actually, in, in release order, I think. But, uh... I, I, it's the same thing for Resident Evil. I did zero first, even though it comes, like, after one or two or something. I do whatever I do. Whatever I decide to do. I guess it depends on how important I think the story is. Recover from a puncture mm, by we did this one, right? Teammates. Finish ahead of your teammate in the race and the standings. Ooh, I started at 14th and my teammates at 8th. Now that the driver's championship has been decided, drivers are looking to boost their own standing. It's been close between you and your teammate Kimi Raikkonen. I don't know, I probably mispronounced that. All season. He is currently fourth, and you are fifth in the table. He's currently leading you by a single point with the last race to run. The race is about to start, and he is in eighth, and you are in fourteenth on the grid. Make sure you finish ahead of Kimi Raikkonen. Hmm. And you just need to get more points than him? Can you finish ahead of your teammate in this season's World Drivers' Championship? I don't know, can I? <laughs> sometimes I do release order, sometimes I do story order. It kind of, it just depends on the series and what I feel like doing. Uh for like, I did my will be focusing their efforts on finishing ahead of their teammates. I'm trying to think of other ones I did in release order. Darksiders I did in release order. By just one point. Darksiders 2 technically takes place between the first or before the first game. But I did Darksiders 1 first. So sometimes I just do release order, not story order, you know. I wasn't listening to anything my engineer guy said to me just now. We're back in Brazil again. Probably just got three penalties. Wait, what? Rip. I don't know how going past him there is a legal maneuver, but... Not Crater Sturl, you're in the queue to you at Yakuza Zero. He's so serious, though! So serious. Yeah. I liked Majima more in the main story. 
Rip. Then uh, he turned into a, a nut job at the end, so not anymore. Rest in peace, Bodzma. More importantly, he got that horrible haircut. Oh my gosh. Oh, I don't want to go to Brazil. Well, too bad. We're on Brazil's course. Penalty. Yeah, I'm at your home. I am. There's a course for a bunch of different countries. Or a track, I guess, technically. There's one for the U.S. as well. That's in Texas. <laughs> okay, uh, I've tried to, like, smoothly take over in the first quarter. It's, it's going great so far. America! Um. Oh, I just put, blew my tire. Ah! 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 I blame that guy for going in front of me. He didn't do that last time. You need to beat Kimmy and finish in eight or higher today if you want to finish the season ahead of your teammate in the driver's table. That's fine. I can drive with a punctured tire. Yeah, sure, sure, sure. Get in front of me, you pieces of garbage. How dare you. Wow. I didn't get any penalties that time. I didn't know that was possible. Careful, we need clean overtake, so we'll face a penalty. How was that not a clean overtake? I'm in the Lotus car. One of the best cars in the game. I'm feeling the handling, man. I'm like, yes! 10 out of 10! Just let me stay in this car for all the scenarios. Check my teammates above eight as well. How dare they be above eight? How dare you? I think I got some practice on this course already. In the other scenario. I don't really care about passing these guys. I'm fine with just tailing them the rest of the race. I'm not greedy. I don't need first. Feels so nice to be in a car with good handling, man. I'm spoiled. It's like, yes. Look at this handling. Overshot that a bit, but 
It's okay. Actually like catching up to Alonzo? Is the, 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 you, you okay, man? You got a cold or something? There we go, there we go. That's more like it. Did he get in a crash or something? He's, he fell way back. What the fuck happened back there? I saw them all bunched up together. Before they left the view of the map. They were having a good time. You gotta stay in front, Alonzo. You can't, you can't let me ta get in front. Too easy. This one's too easy. GG. to the end, Kimi lost his points lead over his Lotus teammate at the final race of the season. <laughs> Remember Kitty of beating kids at pocket circuit with parts worth more than 10 million? I struggled at that, man. I was starting to hate that minigame by the time I finished it because it felt like such RNG sometimes. I was like, ah, how dare you? It's a cool game, though. Clap, clap, clap. <laughs> Applause. <laughs> trophy? Trophy? Achievement? Achievement? Showdown achievement unlocked. Oh, let's forget gold medals and all the teammate scenarios. I call a pilot Kratos because he's bald. I mean, you can't tell under that helmet. Not back. Aww. That's right, Mexican boy. That's right. Ed Pat. I mean, he's never going to take off his helmet for you to know. Championship title. Become a world driver's champion requires a wide range of skill, handling all the different driving conditions that take place in a season. Most of all, the key to being a world champion is consistency while maximizing your points. Or while maximizing your points potential and things out on track don't go as planned. Can you win the World Drivers Championship? No. Although Montreal is going to be rainy. Canada's going to be rainy. This one's Melbourne, Australia. I don't know what Catalonia is though. That's a new track. It'll take some practice. New Delhi's India, I think. Austin is US. Wow. Light rain. Huh. Overcast. I'm not sure what overcast means for handling. I've only ever seen clear or like heavy rain. I wonder what the difference between heavy rain and light rain is. That's what we're gonna find out. Pumpkin spice. Oh, spicy! Spicy! 
I say. That's what now? What the difference in this game between light rain and heavy rain is? Obviously, I know the difference between light rain and heavy rain. IRL, okay? I'm talking about in the game. Antifically having hair would weigh him down so much he'd be slower. There's a wild freely up there. They're known for stealing your trophies. Be careful, mate. That's right. That's right. Better watch out. Let's see what the first one is. Finishing the points at the first race of the season. You need to get your season off to a good start. A much better way of proving that to your team than getting a points finish. You, your qualifying pace was good all weekend. But a small mistake on your hot lap meant that you qualified in 11th place. To make matters worse, you've had to take a 5 place grid penalty for changing the gearbox. Huh? So start the race in 16th. Why would you get a penalty for changing the gearbox? What? What does that mean? I need that in English. You're totally focused on the race, knowing that the car can deliver a good result for you. Earn your first points of the season to get your season up and running. I gotta go from 16th to 10th. At least 10th. That's what now? The wait? Easy rap pro. Easy. Does it, does it mean that like they went to like the pit and changed the gearbox in the pit? I don't get it. I've never seen a five... Wait, I've only gotten time penalties of like 10 seconds. Maybe that's what they mean. I still don't know what, uh, what it means. Uh, that, that. You know I don't know these things. It's like 20 minutes till snacky break. I already take my snacky break now if I want. I did start a little later today. Hmm. It's about the right time. Maybe I should take my snackle break early. Hmm. I'll do one, one try here. Looking down the grid, we can see the second of the Williams cars back in a disappointing 16th place. With this qualifying session a disaster, the team will be looking for him to make early gains and fight for a points finish. Let's make some early gains and end this race in the points. Three laps. Earn at least one point. Okay. Corner cut, legal maneuver, hand it back. Wait, no? I don't have to ha hand it back? Really? Seems like it's too easy when there's sharp corners, man. Wait, this isn't uh, Canada. This is a different track. I recognize this track from, uh, something. I don't know if this was in the season challenge or not. Uh, it's been a while since I've been on this one, though. How dare you guys be faster than me. Alonzo, not happy, man. I haven't driven this track in ages, but I remember it. I did this one a bunch of times for some challenge. I forget what. You think you're doing what? I wasn't paying attention. I almost overshot that. I'm too busy looking in my mirror.
Making Alonzo sad. At least I think that's who's behind me. It's been quite a long while since I've done this track. Surprised I'm doing it so well. Maybe that's just my pro skills. Totally. Not luck or anything. Almost went too fast there. I just break the bunch so he would have to slow down. I don't know if it worked though. Might be a quarter cut. No, nope, that was too slow. I remember doing a lot of struggling on this track a long time ago. Look how far I've come. First time driving this track in ages and I'm doing very well. Oh, hey Alonzo. I don't really care if you pass me or not. But I'm not going to just let you do it. Struggling? I think I am? Nah. The Williams driver was determined not to let a bad grid position spell disaster at the first race of the season today. He was able to push hard, gaining a well earned point scoring position. Uh oh. Alright, I'm gonna take my snackle break now. I wasn't expecting to first try that. I don't recognize Catalonia, so maybe that'll it'll, it'll be, it'll be terrible. Where, where is that? Another gearbox problem. The race has been progressing well for you for you for the race has been progressing well for you so far at Catalonia. With four laps to go, you are in seventh place. Suddenly, without warning, you have lost one of your gears. This is going to slow you down, but can you hold off long enough to bring the car home in seventh place or better? I don't know, can I? Where's my question mark? Handle your gear problems and bring the car home in seventh place or better. I mean, how do, how is that changed when you're in automatic, I wonder? We just skip a gear or something? I don't know. We'll find out after snackle break. Yes, I am still struggling. True. But we've gotten a lot of cool medals today so far, so I think I'm doing pretty well. I've definitely already gotten more gold medals today than I expected to, I gotta admit. I was expecting to still be in rookie 
I'll maybe finish Rookie, be partway through teammate. But I'm already done with Rookie and teammate. I'm in championship. So I'm already, like, way ahead of what my goal was today. Which was finish Rookie and uh, get somewhere in teammate. Clearly, I need to have more confidence in my abilities, right? Be quiet a moment. Is that quiet enough for you? Hey, Niall. What's up? What's happening? How's it going? You're just in time for me to go for a snacky break. <laughs> it's okay, though. We've been getting a bunch of medals to that, now. We're trying to get gold medal in all, all these scenarios. We finished rookie. See all these shiny goals. Finished teammate battle. See all those shiny goals. Now we're in championship. Cool, huh? Overcome a gearbox issue by bringing the car home in seventh or higher. Oh, yeah, okay. The first one was Melbourne, so that was Australia. For some reason, I thought it was Montreal, but that's the third one. I was like, wait, this isn't Canada. Yeah, that was Australia. Mmm, snacks. I'll be super quiet for uh, uh, ages, Dolby, because I'm taking my snackle break. You'll have peace and tranquility for a bit. DRB! Hmm, let's go try out this track. I'm not sure which one Catalonia is. Let's go see. I don't know if it's one I've done before. Or any time recently. I've driven on every track at least once, but... Some I've practiced more than others. It's not looking good for the Sauber driver, as according to our monitors, he's got a gearbox problem. It'll be interesting to see if he can bring the car home in seventh, with that issue affecting his lap times. I don't know what a gearbox issue means. We can confirm you have a gearbox issue. Try and bring the car home in seventh. You want me to defend this position for three laps? Oh, whoa! What the fuck? Gearbox issue is interesting. Uh. Whoa. Yeah, it's definitely interesting. was kind of rude. Should be alright without a gearbox. I think there's still a gearbox, but I think it's just not working properly. They totally knocked me out. I should get disqualified for that. Okay, you've lost one of the gears. It might be a challenge, but try your best to finish seventh. Oh, I've lost a gear. Whichever one. Oh, it was three I lost, I think. Ah! Yeah, I go from one, two to four. I lost third gear. And I am not that familiar with this track. I have to defend though. Defending is easier than gaining. Three laps to go. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, I've got multiple people. How am I gonna defend that? This one kind of reminds me of Suzuka a little bit. Screw you, guy. I totally didn't cut that corner. It was your imagination. Oh shit. He's gonna get DRS on me. Got two more laps to defend. Oh, man. Checked it against multiple incoming ones is a pain. I'll do my best. Defended for three laps. Well, no, she's back. Nothing good ever comes for your turn. Streaming better around break. Understandable. Problem, Salva's number one was able to defend his position and bring home the points. Understandable.
come back from break and you have to watch me drive again. You're like, uh. I had to finish this game four streams ago. Finish ahead of Sebastian Fethel. After a good start, you were able to get yourself into fifth place. But your rival, Sebastian Vettel, has squeezed past his teammate to take first place. You're hoping for some good luck, and it arrives in the form of heavy rain. It's essential you finish ahead of Sebastian Vettel so that you can earn more points than him in the World Drivers' Championship. So I'm supposed to abuse the rain again? Probably would have, but you don't see me complaining. and profile cool. Oh. Oh my gosh, I got rain to deal with now. The rain has returned. The current rain situation could be the opportunity that McLaren have been waiting for. They're looking good on the wets, but have they got enough time to catch and overtake a supreme Sebastian Vettel? Well, let's wait and see. Rain. I'm sure that is now. So slippery. No. 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 You're faster in sector two than the car ahead. Sector two, go for the park. Darn rain. Darn rain. Sign up for a red. Yeah, 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 yeah. This guy's freaking Alonzo. You want me to pass Alonzo? know how to do that area I don't Two laps 
laps until the end of the race. Get back here. Well, slided. Rest in peace. I didn't break quite enough. a shock. We really didn't expect the McLaren driver to finish ahead of Sebastian Vettel's Red Bull car. What a fantastic drive. <laughs> like that. We definitely need that close-up of that bald guy with the camera. Slow mode, too. La, 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 la. Finish, finish in the top six to ensure you... Finish in the top six to ensure you earn a good points haul. What? Your driver's championship rival, Sebastian Vettel, is currently in second place, and you are down in twelfth. Can you make your way up the grid and recover some points? That will be essential to the run-up to the final race of the season. Finish in the top six to ensure you have a good you earn a good points haul. I start at tenth. It's just clear.
Any driver will tell you that consistency is the key to winning a world championship title. With the leading Ferrari down in 10th, he's going to have to act now if he wants to recover something from today's race. Ferrari! Yeah! Good driving, here we come. Good handling, here we go. Okay! Watch me be able to look at that. Wow! I haven't seen this track in a bit. This was in season challenge, wasn't it? Pretty sure it was. It was like early season challenge, I think. Not box! Oh. Next, five seconds separate you. Let's gonna make a corner cut, yeah. I forgot about that corner, okay? Been a while since I've seen this track. I forgot about it. Hello. That guy got a lapped, huh? Oh, okay. I remember which track this is now. Your rival for the championship, Sebastian Vettel, is sat in second place today. We need to grab as many points as we can and finish no lower than sixth. What if he surprises you by getting first instead of second? Bop! Got a mid-turb Wednesday. Got a study! Gotta go study! That's good for your future! Well, watch three. Oh, man, you could, uh, you gotta study. That's way more important. Whoop. Um, I think that counts as a cut corner. Oh, it doesn't? Okay. Well, because it didn't benefit me. I've been a bit since I've done this track. And it wasn't with the Ferrari. It was an early one, so it was uh, an inferior vehicle. That's soon enough for you. I'll study later. It's late. Oh. Probably get some rest then. Barely got that. Rip. Wee Wee. I don't think I'm gonna catch up to everybody else. Not this time. I'm not doing this track smooth enough. It was a season challenge track, but it's been a while. Good night, uh, good night, Guru. Two laps until 
You get your rest. You get your stud. I hope your midterm goes great. Do your best. Doing your best starts with getting some good sleep. I really hope your stream goes well. Yeah, it's been going great! We're already well ahead of where uh, my goal was for today. So anything now is bonus points, right? Bonus medals. We're having a good time. Shake a shake a shake a shake. Oh, wow! That's right. I'll have to try this one again, though. I could catch up a time. Right now we're learning track again. I don't care about the car behind me. I care about the car ahead of me. Rip. I care about what's going on ahead of me, not behind me. I haven't seen a car in ages. Where are they at? Yeah, I'm not catching up to them. I've had two laps of just following them, but not catching and gaining any ground. Definitely have to do better at this track. I keep overshooting. Bop. Rested in peace, me. Didn't drive well enough to catch up to anybody. Ah. Only caught up to like the last place guy, the first guy I passed. These ones where you have to catch up are the toughest ones. The defending ones, I, I'm first trying. The one where I have to catch up. Tougher. The Ferrari driver's plan of consistently finishing in the top end of the points has been broken today. With him finishing outside the top six, it means it's likely he won't be challenging for the driver's championship. Darn. Let's try again. I don't think I did that very well. Rip.
to ensure we can still challenge Vettel in the fight for the championship, we need you to finish no lower than sixth today. Oh, I got the fastest lap. That's because I'm a super pro. I say as I fuck up that corner. Fucked up. And the uh, fucked up. Goodbye, callers in front. It's been nice knowing you. I miss you all. care about behind? Why do you tell me about behind? I want to know how far ahead the other guys are. Not how far behind the guy behind is. How far behind am I? Not the other words. No, so I'm supposed to look top left. Supposed to look top left for that information. I don't think I'll be able to catch up. I'll do my best, though. Still can't even DRS, though. How dare you not to let me DRS? Let's make quarter cut. Ah! Shit. Rip. It's gonna be a quarter cut. Didn't consider that an illegal maneuver? Really? I don't have to give the position back? Oh, I was on standard for this one.
What about you? That's not a corner cut either, though. That shit. Rip. Kills me trying to get greedy. Kills <clears throat> me trying to get greedy. Not gonna get it this time. And horseshoes after her. Whee! Uh, I don't know if that'll count. That's called cheating, right? If it counts. Ferrari driver was able to finish within the top six today, keeping to the team's plan of finishing well in the points. Get wrecked. I got like fourth. Power of cheese wins. Finish the race in seventh or above to become the world driver's champion. What a season it's been so far. You've outshone your competitors with consistent point scoring throughout. You now have the opportunity to come away from the Grand Prix of Americas as the world driver's champion, but you must finish the race in seventh or above. Unfortunately, you spin the car in the first lap and are way down in 16th! But a safety car incident bunches the pack back together. Seize the chance to overtake, reach 7th, and win the championship. Finish the race in 7th or above to become the world driver's champion. I need to pass everybody when there's like a corner or some shit. Austin. I haven't done Austin in a bit. Isn't that what the one with the little curves that go like, wee, 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 wee? I think it is. I'm dubbed about I'm dubbed. That was an early season challenge one too. Just like the last one. Oh, I've forgotten how to do it. Oh no! Oh no! If the Red Bull driver can take advantage of this safety car period and use it to get himself into seventh or higher, then he'll be bringing home the driver's championship today. Safety car is coming in this lap. Here we go! I have no idea what safety car means. It's lightly raining on this one, right? Lightly rain. Safety car deployed. What the fuck does that mean? You don't get many second chances. When the safety car comes in this lap, begin working your way up to seventh or higher. What the fuck's a safety car? Why am I being forced to slow down? Is it forcing me to not pass the guy? Oh. So, I cannot pass right now? I don't get it. If I pass with this uh, like this, uh, I'm screwed, huh? How, how is this supposed to help me if I can't pass anybody? Okay, well, I don't understand your safety car nonsense. How am I supposed to pass people if it doesn't let me pass people? It penalizes me for trying to pass people. What the heck is a safety car for anyway? You don't on a safety? That's so weird. Mm 
Is it still a safe day? Probably since the game's forcing me to go slow. Ugh. I suddenly let go and was like, okay, there you go. Interesting. That was kind of weird. Probably not cut in the corner there. All right, man. I scared him. It occurs when there's a crash requires marshals and machinery on track. Oh, like a big crash, huh? It allows the race to keep going, huh? It'll have to stop and take a break. I don't give a shit about that. I care about this. That's gonna be a quarter cut. What I'm surprised about is that's not an illegal maneuver. I'll need to hand it back. Could you not bop me, please? Just let me take over, Ben. I vaguely recall this track. It's a bit of a different beast on the... Whee! Uh, it's a bit of a different beast on the wet track, though. Not gonna be any DRS for a while. Four seconds is a big gap. I keep overshooting this. Or undershooting it, I guess. I was tempting to d go there for. I don't think I'll catch up this time. Hmm. 
Not this time. Are you kidding? Fuck off. That's like the babiest corner cut. Rip. Almost, but not quite. I'll have to try again. You optimal? What does that mean? In the Red Bull garage, the mechanics look fairly sober, and rightly so. They've just watched the World Drivers' Championship hopes fade away. Oh. Okay, guys, I'll, I, I'll, I'll do it. You don't get many second chances. When the safety car comes in this lap, begin working your way up to seventh or higher. I think you mean after it leaves. Obviously, right now I can't do it. Either. Wet to weather conditions. DRS disabled. How dare they be disabled? I get a penalty for that? Three laps to go. I don't think I'll get this one either. How dare they not let me just get in front and stuff. How dare they actually not want me to get in front and things. Oh, rude. They were like, hey! Watch me get blamed for that somehow. No, okay. Can't ever tell where the first corner apex is. It's like, oh, right, it's there.
What? Overside again. Not looking too good for me. One that is overshoot. Mon has slow zones. They do? That sounds pretty cool. care about the car behind me. It could be 0 0.05 seconds behind me and I wouldn't care about that. That's not the port part. Ah, shit. Rip. I just fucked it up. I just lost it. I just lost the race by overshooting that one quarter. Rip. Probably should have flashbacked. Overshot this corner again! Ah! Ah! Can't the, can I just not over fucking shoot? Can I just like do good? Do well? Not fuck up? Nope. Fuck it up is what I live for. I'll probably get penalized for that. I knew it! I can't flashback that either. That's GG. <sighs> That's me. That's my sanity. Wait, what? You can't just start me facing away from the road. That's rude. Attack once the safety car comes in at the end of this lap. You need to place seven The tough part is you only have one flashback, so you can only make one mistake. You have to decide, is this mistake a killer? Is this mistake worth it? Corner cut. Oh? Too slow for corner cut. Three laps to go. Whee! That was a great overtaking maneuver. You made that look easy. Thank you, thank you. Accomplished with much suffering. Much practice. All right. Oh, come on. 
that slight tap on that quarter is a quarter cut, but everything else is fine. Such a picky game. I think it all, all depends on how fast you're going at the time. What? You're going slow. That's not a corner cut. We're into the final couple of laps. Ah, fuck off. Fuck off. This is it, seventh place. If you finish in this position, you'll be the world driver's champion. Woohoo. Corner cut. No, not corner cut. Oh, okay. Brykinen's next. Line him up for a pass. Eh, I don't know if I want to. What if uh, I get punished? What if I get a penalty? I guess I could. I didn't get penalized for that somehow. I didn't really mean to bop him though. Next corner cut I get is going to give me a penalty. Now I'm going to be a careful driver, right? Totally. I'll know about that. Second. Hamilton, what's going on, man? Baton! I'm behind Baton. That's exciting. Behind who? No, I'm behind. Behind. Baton. Uh. Uh. Woohoo! Behind somebody? Yeah! Baton was ahead of me. I imagine the Red Bull mechanics and their World Drivers Champion will be throwing quite the celebration tonight. What a fantastic result that was. Woohoo! Who is Baton? Baton! Baton! You remember now? You remember now? Baton! Uh, I'm glad you remember. That's the last one for championship, isn't it? Another achievement incoming. Got more achievements today than I thought I would. I'm super cool.
an achievement unlocked. Now it's just final year. <laughs> Brazil's the last one again. Light rain this time, huh? I have no idea what Kuala Lumpur is. Monte Carlo? Silverstone? Oh, I know where Silverstone is. Spa? Spa's a nice one. I like spa. When it's time to retire from the sport, what type of driver will you be remembered as? Will you be quickly forgotten, or will you be known as a legend of the track? These scenarios will see how you'll handle your final year in the sport. Are you to leave the sport disappointed with what could have been, or finish your career on a high? <gasps> I'm retiring. I'm out now. I'm too out to be racing no more. Remember Solo Foggy? You weren't expecting that, were you? Baton! Baton! You remember now. The power of the batons. Pressing batons is exciting, too. You're right, you were. Phew! Good. Driving on ice. Warm tires into a third place finish. You've made good progress in the race to get up to, up to, up to, why is up to one word? Up to third after your final pit stop. Unfortunately, you've been struggling for grip all weekend, and this is meant earlier than expected pit stops. You are on your final stint on primes, which are beginning to fall off the cliff. Can you manage your tires over the next few laps and finish on the podium? Although, can I? Can you look after your tires and bring the car home in third place? I don't understand all these can yous. That implies a question, but there's never any question marks. I have a grammatical problem with these summers. I'm at third. Basically, I have to defend my current position. I'm not sure which track this is either. Expect a snowstorm before that. Oh, greedy. We're in the final stages of the Malaysia Grand Prix where we're starting to see one of the Ferraris struggle with tire wear. He'll need careful driving if he's going to defend his position and bring home a podium finish. It's Malaysia, huh? Was that one in season challenge? I don't think so. I don't know if, uh, how much practice I've got on this one. Whoa. Whoa. They aren't looking too good, though. Wah! I don't know this track. It's gonna make it interesting. What? I'm just following the racing line. Be like, I'm going where I'm doing what? Right. Oh shit. That's GG right there. <clears throat> Oh, shit. You've taken 
suffered some slight damage to the front wing. You should be okay to stay out. Hello, fellow Ferrari. Yeah, you can let your teammate stay in front, can't you? This kind of rude. Try to pass me. I'm I'm having tire trouble after all. You gotta be nice to me. I'll be nice to your teammate. I'm pleased to say you're the fastest car in sector one. You're doing a great job. This is a curve. This reminds me of Shanghai's. Or whatever the China one was called. Not quite as bad, though. Sure, the handling is not as good, but it's still a fucking Ferrari. Imagine having these worn tires on like a cater hat. Good luck trying to fucking steer. Like, don't take out your teammate. My teammate almost took out me. That's different. What are you, what are you talking to me for? Oh, he's gonna have DRS. Excellent work so far. This is your last lap. Keep finding the grip and hold on to third. Warning caused a collision. Do I get a penalty though? He just warned me. How did I cause a collision? That guy hit me. You guys are slightly ridiculous. Two cars. Neither one's a good saw. tire wear issues the Ferrari driver was able to deliver a fantastic drive and hold on to a podium position the final stretch though before the final turn was dicey the had two cars coming up one on each side of the road so if I went to defend one I'd be giving the other one a chance to pass it was dicey You also get really tired at one point at night, but if you push through it, all of a sudden you're fine. Yeah! Love 30, you're like, I'm gonna go to sleep. 
120, your body's like, fine, I guess we're staying awake now. A little while though, you're gonna be like, <sighs> all over again. No, you're not, Dolby. You're not greedy. Hmm. I don't know about that. Make it back to the pit safely to replace your damaged front wing. Then finish the race ahead of Nico Rosberg. You start the race in ninth place, two places ahead of your rival, Nico Rosberg. Unfortunately, you clip a back marker, causing you to lose your front wing. You need to get back to the pits and try to and rescue your race. Make sure you finish ahead of Nico Rosberg. Make it back to the pits safely to get a new front wing and then finish the race ahead of Nico Rosberg, huh? So this is basically just like the uh, one in the rookie where you have to pit to replace your front wing and then you have to gain four positions. We'll have to see how many positions this one is. Monte Carlo? Which one is this? Monaco? <gasps> this one's Monaco? I'm gonna go die. I don't think I'm getting this one today. Ruffle Pog! I know, right? You've been waiting for the Monaco scenario. I have to also have to see how far behind Nico Rushberg I am. Oh no! The Force India driver has lost his front wing! He's definitely gonna have trouble getting back to the pits! Lewis Hamilton and Nico Rosberg will be pleased now with the advantage he's given them. Uh, I don't know where the pit is on this track. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah. Oh my gosh. You need to pit in this lab. Okay, but well where's the pit? Ah! This one's gonna be fun. Oh, it's over here. Wait, what? So you have to call me greedy, not explaining why you wanted snow buttons. That's so greedy. Hey, Blue Up, what's up? What's happening? How's it going? I don't have much practice on this track, though. Ah, fuck off. Rip. I think Monaco's happening next time. Just a guess. So many stupid curves. Ah! Oh, I forgot to use my curves. Wait, what? Where was the corner? I didn't see an obvious corner. Must all be pavement. 
not be a very obvious looking quarter. Hard this one sucks too. I see the court. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I saw the corner. I see the corner now. Oh, I see where the corner is. It's kind of well hidden. I should put some grass there or something. I only saw the red there, and I was like, oh, that is corner. Might be on this one a while, because I don't have hardly any practice on Monaco, and I hate Monaco. Those two things are probably not going to help me. Worst track in the game, out there. If I want to go on the grass, I should be able to go on the grass. What, why do you have walls? I think it should be against the rules. I keep forgetting about this. God damn it. I can't undo that one other. We've been given a time penalty. It'll be added to your time at the end of the session. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not catching up to Nico Rosberg with all this wall bop that I'm doing. Well, I got stuck on the wall. This one's happening tonight. It's about sleepy time, anyway. You can totally have fun with Monaco next time. I look forward to. I look forward to. Uh... Yeah, it keeps getting further and further away. There they have this stupid cut here. And this one here. How dare they? I want to crash into the wall. How dare they stop me from doing that? I'm stuck. Rip. strikes again for the aging Force India driver. Not the results he'll be after, especially in his retirement year. Oh, no! Oh, sad. That's not happening today, though. 
Or play Apple twice rib dog play with you. Ah. Need to nerf that leaderboard achievement. I don't trophy. How dare they? <laughs> They'll never do. That's gonna be it for me today. My hands are have had enough. The the, the Monaco. I'm a go. There they. How dare they do that to me? How dare they do that to me? To me! Well, next time we will uh, get the rest of these medals. What will I do after that? I don't know. Let a quitter. I know, right? It's only like time to go to sleep. I only got golds on like all this other shit. Then uh, that scenario mode will be done. Also, ones for time attack, but I think I'll do those ones last. I hear they're the toughest. Or at least according to somebody, that's the toughest thing. Only 540. Oh? Am I supposed to go until uh, 3 a.m. or some shit? Powerful stare. What's wrong with going to bed before 2 a.m. for once in my life? Like I'm supposed to. I'm supposed to. I'm supposed to go to sleep around 1:30. How dare I actually do that? You just want me to suffer at Monaco some more. You just want me to suffer some more. <laughs> Let's see, there's one for final year scenario mode. There's one for gold medals in all scenarios in scenario mode. When I finish the final year one, I'll get the one for all of them, too. And then after that, there's a bunch of uh, career ones. There's one, two, three, four. There's like five career achievements. And then after that, there's just two more, I think. I'm a tech. Time and all time attack scenarios. Achieved gold and time attack classic 80s challenge. That's supposedly the toughest one. According to somebody in the solution for it. They're like, it's the toughest. Well, next time we'll finish scenario mode. Maybe. If Monaco doesn't decide that this is where I, where I end my F1 2013 career. We'll get it with enough practice. I don't have much practice on that track. Ooh, I guess it's time for that to change. Darn. I was hoping I could escape from Monaco. Never have to do it again. Obviously, I have to do it again because career has every track in the game, so. Next time we'll finish in there, we all, probably. And then we will fin- well, we'll start career. We're not gonna finish career. Not a chance. In career, we have to win the driver's championship. We have to win the constructor's championship. We have to qualify last, but finish first. We have to move to another team mid-season in career. And then we have to do something called elected to end R&D on the current season's car in career, which apparently you do in the second- second season? You have to do one season of career, and then in the second one you get some R&D or something like that. I'll have to read up on it. Exactly what I have to do. Ooh. And there I be the one to suggest you stay and race more like. Oh. I know, right? If it was uh, somebody else who said it, I would totally do it. Wait, no, I wouldn't. I would still go to sleep. Ooh. 
So let's see, four more gold medals in scenario. And then we start the career funsies. I'm gonna have to read up on the strategy for the career ones. I don't have to do them on hard at least. I can do them on amateur. Should feel like a breeze after gold difficulty scenario, which is probably hard difficulty, right? It'd feel like a breeze after season challenge on hard and the gold scenarios, right? Career on easy will be easy, right? I definitely won't crash and burn and have to retry 12 times, right? 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 Yeah, probably. Wait, wait, wait. Where's my cute cat? That's enough video games for today! For today! I need to rest my hands anyway. Stop, stop, stop bullying me. How dare you? How dare you? How dare you, young man? How dare you? That was another hip hopping and bopping, popping, vroom and stream. One session closer to finishing this game. We're running out of things to do, aren't we? Just four more scenario races. And then all the ones in career. Although career is a big thing, it's 19 races. But after career's done, it'll just be time attack. And that'll be it. Hard to believe there's only a few different modes left to do. It felt like there was a bajillion things to do when I first started. I had the tutorial gold medals. I had all those season challenge things. I was crazy. Anyway, I'm going to sleep. I'm tired. I need to rest my hands and the rest of me. You have a good night. And take care of yourself, though. But good night, Woo Up. Good night, Mexican boy. Good night, Pie Thief Nile. Our row, everybody. Boss lurkers, everybody who stopped by tonight. I'll be back before you know it. We'll be back with Neptunia tomorrow. We'll progress through our first playthrough. We got this. We got this. Whoosh. You all take care of yourselves. Oh, I'll vroom vroom some more next time.